Hi everyone, this is Isabel the Shabby Hippie. I hope you're all doing well. Um, welcome back to my channel and welcome to my new subscribers. I'm here today to do a little crafting and I guess probably some chit chatting. Um, so yeah, I'm going to be working on uh, the journal that I am making uh, as a design team, uh, as a design project for <laughs> for uh, Lena who is junk journal craft Lena oh a design team project see here I go already so I have not started I just have like a whole bunch of things here uh, collected and um, so please excuse the mess I'm not sure what I'm gonna make well no I, kn I know I'm gonna make a journal <laughs> I meant like I don't know um, what I'm gonna make today but I did see these um, napkins that I had already used um, well there's one that's not used um, and I had them on the side here and I'm like oh maybe I could make something with that so I'm not sure yet um, this is a little master board that I made out of a book page um, and I thought maybe I could cut it up and make some tags so um, but you know I'm starting to think that um, Maybe I should, yeah, that's just going to take time. <laughs> it's going to take more time. All right, so you know what? Let's start with, um, I think, okay, yeah. I have, I had made, um, I had made this little tag. And I think I'm just, I'm definitely going to use that in the, in the book. And then um, these here are from this kit, from Lena's kit. And I did cut them, obviously cut them out. Um, but then I also have some library uh, cards and some guest checks. So I think I might play with them. I also have um, odds, just a lot of odds and ends. So let, yeah, let me get started. Otherwise, I'm never going to finish. <laughs> so I even have yeah more odds and ends in there so um so yeah let me what i'm gonna do is let me grab i'm, I'm really liking how this is like matching with this sort of so i might use that one and then we'll see we'll see what else i can come up with um and then because this is green i was thinking about doing it on the guest check but because it's green um I think maybe I should just do it on the library card. Um, I think it'll show up better. Let's see here. Yeah, I think so. Oh, guys, I um, I hope you're all doing well. Um, I feel a little nervous, uh, probably because I haven't been able to actually craft. Um, uh, like this in a while. I've done odds and ends. I've actually I did do um, two little projects. Um, they're very little um, for, I'm sorry, I'm just taking out um, baby wipe. Well, a sanitation wipe. <laughs> so, I, in case I need it um, for the glue. But yeah, uh, let's see where I put it, right here. Um, so, I did, I did do something for um, that I'm gonna, I want to put into my Etsy shop. Oh, look at that cute little bee up there. Mm. Oh, I think that, I like that there actually. And then there's this too, which kind of, oh wow. Oh guys, I don't know which, which side to use. And then there's a the nice little butterfly, but then I'll lose. Oh, well actually, oy, oy, oy. what do I do? What do I do? <clears throat> All right. All right, let's let's just put some glue down and see what happens. So yeah, um, I did. I made two little things for my um, Etsy store, which I'll be showing hopefully this sometime this week if nothing else happens. And uh, <laughs> yeah, like I said, there's a lot happening, and um, yeah, so. So I feel a little nervous. I don't want to go all the way up with this. I think I'm just going to kind of leave it up to there and see what sticks and what doesn't. So I'm just going to use this here. All right. And 
Let's see here. I think I am going to use the little bee. The little bee, the bee, 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 bee. Oh gosh, I feel so nervous. This is crazy. My hands are actually shaking. Um, I'm just, I don't know. I'm just, I've been a mess lately. My doctor had to um, up my meds and everything. So, which also, it helps me, but it also prevents me from doing more stuff because then I, okay, so here I'm just going to tear and hopefully, and pray for the best here. Um, uh, but the meds do make me more drowsy, so that means I sleep a little more now. Oh goodness, and I hate it because I feel like my day just goes by and I don't do much and it's frustrating. But, um, yeah, so, uh, let me just update you a little bit with some of the things that have been going on. Um, some have been with, um, my granddaughter and, um, and yeah, it's, I just can't say much, but, uh, it's not, well, it's partially her health and, um, she's lost like a an immense amount of weight and it's uh, she wasn't overweight to begin with so it's just been um, crazy and it's all due to stress and um, a lot of problems that she's having um, and then there's uh, yeah she's very very thin right now and we're all worried about her um, but I mean she's still active you know she's um, she's doing things you know uh, she started a new job this week actually yesterday she started and uh, uh, so yeah she's she's doing okay but she needs uh, more help with uh, her her health <laughs> and um, and then uh, of course there's my daughter who who always has her health issues as well um, and the baby, um, um, then there's my godparents who, um, well, my godmother had open heart surgery, um, hmm, sometime, I, th I would say it was, I don't know, sometime in August, September, uh, possibly, and, um, she was over here in New Jersey. Well, I don't live in New Jersey. I live in Pennsylvania, but um, she was, you know, much closer to us. And um, uh, right before Christmas, she and my godfather went to back to Puerto Rico. And this is what we have so far. Um, and um, they bought a house over there, and uh, things were going slightly better you know she was getting well and everything but then all of a sudden she um bent down to get um some pots and pans or something and um she she started screaming in pain and uh, my godfather took her to the hospital and they said they couldn't find anything and then they gave her some pain meds and she's 86 um, and, um, with open heart surgery, you know, from less than a year ago, and then she, he took her back home, and then days passed, a week passed, and she was still in the same excruciating pain, um, okay, so we got our first one done, sort of, I mean, we might do more decorating, but I'm just trying to get some stuff done, um, so, yeah, I wonder if this one, goes with anything uh, uh, not really um, so they brought her he brought her home and then a week later he had to take her back um, I don't remember if there's any birds in this journal <laughs> um, he had to take her back only he couldn't take her back because by that time you know his back is out and he's older too <laughs> and um, so uh, um, they, he called the ambulance and they took her back to the hospital and then they, they 
did something, uh, they found um, some old fracture and they said it's due to that fracture. Boom, that's pretty. Um, hold on there, hold on. Um, this color kind of goes, I'm not sure, but it's a little too bright, I think. Um, so they, yeah, and then, so, okay, so they gave her yet more meds. She was in the hospital for a couple days and then they sent her home. So from then, she just kept getting worse and worse and worse um, to the point where she was not being able to get out of bed. She was not being able to go to the bathroom by herself. And then, of course, things are getting worse than for my godfather. So then, thank God that they actually moved right next door to my brother-in-law, who is an angel. <laughs> my husband's name is Angel. Um, but <laughs> they're both angels. I can't say my husband's not. My husband is an angel. But um, the my brother-in-law has been so helpful to them. And he actually, he's a big guy. And um, uh, he went to my um, godparents. And he's been going there and helping them. Uh, he lifts her up and puts her in the chair. And, um, you know, he's... He's just helping a lot, thank God. And um, so, but then, um, again, her pain was so terrible. And um, maybe this one here. I don't know if you guys can see what I'm doing. I'm so sorry. Um, that they called the ambulance again. They took her to the hospital. They... Um, ran some more tests they couldn't find anything else so but they gave her a lot of meds and all of a sudden she became almost like I don't know like so drugged up that she couldn't respond she couldn't talk she couldn't eat she couldn't do anything and um it was very scary for my for all of us especially us being here and you know even if she were here I can't do a lot because I can't bend I can't um I can't do uh, lift I can't lift I can't bend um my my hands are bad my back is bad my legs are bad <laughs> so but at least I would be there maybe hopefully comforting her in some way and maybe trying to at least cook for them or something because there are days that I can't cook even for myself but um but yeah so uh, um in the meantime I'm getting worse over here too with all the stress, um, there are days that I have not been able to walk at all. My husband has to come home and do all the cooking and washing the dishes after he, and I, that just makes me feel horrible. I know he doesn't mind, but it's just, it makes me feel really, really bad because he's, you know, he's, he's, t he gets tired too. He's human and, um, he doesn't complain or anything, but it just makes me feel terrible. So, um, between those problems and other problems that I'm not even mentioning right now. <laughs> um, it's just, it's just been overwhelming. It's been a lot. Oh, okay. Come on. We can do this. And, um, oh, um, and it, it's caused me to, you know, get more, um, meds to control my anxiety and okay let's do it this way i'm going to turn it around and the reason i want this is because it's got two butterflies right here so um so it, it's just been really hard and it's like we're all struggling it's like the whole entire family is struggling um and it doesn't sound like a lot i know but trust me it's been a lot and even like I said even more than what I'm saying right now um <clears throat> I'm sorry oh but see I didn't realize that that had like that line going through oh oh well I thought that was just the actual fold but uh apparently it wasn't it has a straight line going up and down <clears throat> oh well what's done is done right so yeah, um, it, it's just been really hard and overwhelming and um, just 
wanting to help everyone, but I really can't yet. Everybody kind of runs to me because it's like... <laughs> My daughter calls, says I'm the the matri matriarch of the family, okay? So, Mom, you pray. Mom, <laughs> Mom this, Mom that. I mean, no, sh don't get me wrong. She helps me. She helps me so much. Um, but, you know, it's it's like my granddaughter, she, she calls me 24-7. And, um, yeah, I don't even know what to tell her half the time anymore because they're just... I don't have the solutions for everything. and And even when you can give them some good advice sometimes they just don't want to take it and you know I I can't I don't know what else to say I don't know what else to think and I'm just I've just been going nuts and um, and then of course well when my pain gets really unbearable and I can't walk then you know I don't know what else to do but yeah I still try to be there for them um, yeah and that's pretty much what's been going on so, um, oh, I did get some good news yesterday. My godmother, um, which had um, gone to back to the hospital, um, uh, they thought they were going to put her on dialysis because she is she was a candidate for dialysis. Well, her granddaughter told me yesterday that thank God for now, for now they're not going to do it because. Um, her blood sugar levels are stable and her I don't know something else I think it was her her blood pressure and um, yeah so that was really good news um, she's back home now they're trying to find um, nurses to go to the house and help out with you know her necessities and, and with everything and give her therapy and oh my goodness there's just so much but um yeah, so she's, I mean, I guess she's slightly better. Um, she's not in that agonizing pain that she was, but she is still in pain. She still can't get up on her own or anything like that. I have not been able to talk to her for weeks because every time that I try, you know, that I call, she's sleeping because she's medicated and, um, yeah, and then there was that time where she wasn't responding much, um, eating or talking or anything. And it's, yeah, it was really scary because my godmother is like my mom. You know, she's my mom's sister. She was my mom's little sister. Um, and, uh, and, sh and so she's my aunt and she's my godmother. But, you know, she's, we've always been together just, you know that's just how it's been and then so I don't know so when I know that they're sick or something's wrong with them both of them my godmother and my godfather then I get I get really antsy and worried okay so we have a library card and we have a guest check and then we have um, an anxious person here <laughs> just Oh my goodness, uh, I hate I hate this feeling, but um, I just hope it gets better soon because I need to function a little better. Um, okay, so we have those two, at, which I'll decorate later. And then right now, I think what I'm going to do is I am going to cut these down, or this down that I have made, you know, in between here and there, because a lot of times when I try to craft, I can't either, so that's another problem. So, I don't know how long this is. Hold on. Let me see here. Oh, this is, oh, it's almost nine inches. Almost nine. So, let's do, like, I think I'm going to cut them at two and three quarters to make tags. That's what I'm, that's what I'm going to do. Two and three quarters. Okay. Right here. Oh, cute. And right here. Come on. We can do this. Yes, we can. Right here. 
right there. Two and three quarters. And then this one is going to be a wider one. This one is approximately three and a half. Yeah, three and a half. So that's good. <clears throat> so we can either make it into a tag or make it into, <coughs> excuse me, a packet or a journaling card. Yeah, it doesn't matter. So, okay, so what I'm going to do with these now is I'm going to back them um, with this, uh, uh, this old um, piece of uh, copy paper that I had dyed a while back, and it, it's ripped, so that's why I haven't used it, but, um, yeah, so I think I'm just gonna, um, uh, back this with that and use my handy dandy glue here my glue whoopsie my glue stick and um, <clears throat> and then see when I come oh, when I come back then maybe I can start decorating these tags or I'll start putting the journal together so that I can know how to decorate the tag so I know which where they're gonna go exactly um, yeah I need an, uh, gonna need another glue stick soon obviously obviously mm -hmm, mm -hmm. yeah like my granddaughter my great granddaughter says she's like yeah yeah well she doesn't say it much anymore though but uh, yeah she's growing she'll be three in July oh my gosh She's so gorgeous. God bless her. She's so smart. I don't know. I don't know how kids are. It seems like kids are smarter nowadays than they used to be. <laughs> I don't think I, I knew as much as she does when I was three years old. <laughs> oh my goodness. Yeah, it's like, goodness. They can. I think they, I, I think they can become millionaires at four or five. <laughs> I guess she just. She knows so much. Where's the other one? Here it is. Okay. Oh, no. It does not fit. Okay. But it's okay. It's okay. I should have just literally pasted that whole thing on here and then cut it. But uh, I didn't think of it until now. Yeah. So, um, I hope you're all doing well. I hope you had a good Easter. I know it's it's been a couple weeks now, but... Um, I hope, you know, that everything is well, and I know that we're all going through things, or most of us anyway, and, um, I know some of my friends, um, meaning you guys out there are going through things with yourself and or your family, and I'm praying for you, I really am, because that is, if there's one thing I do is I pray, I do pray, um, <clears throat> excuse me, I pray a lot, and, um, here we go, um, and I'm always praying for my friends and family, so, all right, and then this one, which is wider, I'm still going to back it, even though, <laughs> um, even though it's, um, I'm not sure what I'm going to do with it, but yeah, still, it still needs some backing, so it's going to get it. I wonder if I have another, I, sh I had another glue stick around here somewhere, so, but if not, it's okay, I'll just go to the kitchen where I have my other ones. I, ha I bought a new, a whole box of these um, from Amazon not too long ago, and they're in the kitchen. Because, yeah, I use them a lot. I mean, I use all sorts of glues. Uh-oh. All right. We can do this. We can do this. Yes, we can. Maybe we can. Maybe we can't. Go. Oh, oh, it went up a little bit. Oh, and it went back down. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Um, oh, come on. I just need a little bit more. That's all. That's all, dude. All right. I think that should do it. Hopefully. 
um, let me try and put it down here as straight as I can so that um, waste not want not you know um, I'm I'm very frugal with everything that I do I like I like to save as much paper as I can because it'll be it'll help me with something else I guess I'm hoping anyway so here we go here's the lid or the top however you want to say it and now I'm just gonna actually I should just go in with this and cut it with this so that I can um, do it faster um, let's see y'all uh, I can't see there, maybe, I think. Uh, all right, let's just go there. Um, so yeah, these I just did with all, all of my scraps that I had laying around. Well, not all of them, um, but with scraps, I guess I should say that I had laying around. Um, and, uh... So I, I used, obviously the, the back was a book page, and then I also use um, dictionary page, a different, that's a different dictionary, this is a different one, and um, some little, oh this label here was actually, is from Lena, um, I don't know if she still has them, she may have them in her um, coffee shop, um, but they were from her and you can definitely check out her coffee shop she always provides um, beautiful images um, she makes but she gives she does oh lord I can't talk um, she provides uh, freebies and um, and also things for, for sale okay so not too bad and then let's see here again just wanted to make sure that I had that in perspective all right there's one and then here let's see here I can't see <laughs> oh it's just a itty bit it's just a little itty bit okay did I get anything yes I did okay <laughs> just a little bit <laughs> um, <clears throat> yeah so Lena oh, oh I, this is lifting uh, Lena always has um, beautiful images and she does um, uh, sewing kits as well I don't know if you guys have seen the gorgeous stunning flowers that she makes and her crochet work um, so she sells um, slow stitch kits if you guys didn't know and if you're interested um, yeah just go to her shop and check it out because it's yeah she's very talented Lena is super duper talented all right well what happens when you can't see oh here we go oops whoopsie there we go and um i guess i should stop this here because uh, i just looked up and we're at 28 minutes so i um i hope you enjoyed this guys and uh, i hope you come back i will try to keep um working on this journal online so that um not online what am I talking about on YouTube <laughs> um, so that I can actually make it and and um, and what and um, and be with you guys because I miss you guys so all right I'm gonna let you go and I um, I hope you're all doing well and again I will talk soon all right take care bye bye